Can we talk about it? The girl who cried wolf. Carly Russell was just charged on two misdemeanors of filing false police reports. And listen, I hate this situation because all the resources that they spent on her could have been spent looking on other real missing black girls. And I hate that this was a hoax. And I hate that she used this whole situation to get some sort of clout or fame off of whatever the situation was, whatever she did. We don't even know the full story yet of why she did what she did. But listen, it's a lot of girls that's going missing, especially black young women that aren't going to be looked for now because of this. And this is the real worst part about this whole situation. That's a lot of girls that are actually missing, that actually need police resources and all of us putting all our attention to look for them. And these girls are just going to go under the radar now because of this one black girl lied. And it was already not putting resources towards finding black lost people and people of color. So now they're going to put even less. So this is just... This whole situation is everything about this was just been off. And now that we got an almost conclusion of it, I just feel real bad about the actual missing people that's going on missing. Just because she decided to lie and cheat on her boyfriend and do whatever she did. This story has just been crazy from the beginning. It was never no baby. It was never no kidnapping, no abduction. It was all a hoax. Again, so all these resources that they put into looking for her, they could have been spent looking for some other girl that has actually been kidnapped, has actually been trafficked. Because this stuff is really going on. And now it's going to go under the radar more because they're not going to believe the next girl that actually does go missing for real. And I just think this is an overall tragic situation. And I hate that it happened to a black woman because the black woman already is not getting the resources and police coverage that she got. And they're going to get even less now because now if you... A police officer, you gonna the first thing in your mind, the black girl go missing, you think you're gonna think of she playing a Carly e. Russell. And I hate that. I really, really hate that. Everything about the situation was off and I wanna pray for this young girl because doing all of this for attention is just like out of line. Like you never should have included a baby. You never should have just said you went missing. If you're gonna lie to your boyfriend, lie to him in peace. Lie to him honestly. You don't gotta fake lies. And then he drag you in the mud too. Now the boyfriend said, I, I knew she was bipolar and I knew she was crazy and a bunch of other stuff. So you're gonna get the attention you wanted, girl. That's what I said. Everybody get what they want now in this digital age. You're gonna get the attention you want because your name is forever a joke. You are the girl who cried wolf. So they're gonna use your name every time another black girl gone missing and isn't getting the resources dedicated to finding her, they're gonna put your name next to her. So you're gonna get the fame that you wanted. You actually gonna get infamy. So can we talk about it? A lot of y'all knew this was a hoax from day one. Again, and I hate that this comes to this conclusion, but you know, everybody get what they want. And to the real missing black girls, like, this is tragic. This is whole